So I want to give you an example of what I have to do to actually put it in. See, it will not go over unless I do that. It will not go over. I have to, I have to wiggle or up and down until it turns. All right, YouTube, here's another video for you guys. This video right here is because I have an ignition switch that is acting up. So what I have to do is exchange this whole ignition switch out, which this is a amateur hour episode. This is what I'm gonna try to do this myself without having to go to a mechanic. And it's also teaching me and I'm learning how to maintain a vehicle for myself, you know what I mean? Some things I'm not gonna be able to do to uh, make sure this thing runs right, but the things that I can, I'm going to try to do. So today we're gonna to start on the ignition switch. This is after I've done the tail lights and the headlights. So let me, let's get to it and I'm gonna, uh, Pull this part out and let you see what it looks like. I'll be right back with you. All right, so what we have here is the ignition switch and the keys that come with it. Let me open that up for you. So here it is, the ignition switch and the key. So what I'm supposed to do is put this in, but when I take it out, I'm supposed to, it's a thing on top where I have to stick a tool in here and release this part just to pull the one that I have out of it. So I had to go buy a tool to even do that part. Also to get the screws out, I needed torque pick keys, which I had got those ordered and those are here as well. So here is the, the tool kit that I am going to try to use to push that pin out. And let me see if I can find the Torx bit screws. One second. So here is the Torx bit screw, torque bit set. Gotta slow it down, I'm country, man. I got a lisp, so, you know, it is what it is. So this right here, there are screws up under here that I have to get out just to take this thing off so once i get this thing off at least lift it up i can push this in put the key in let me get over here put the key in twist it to the own and from what i've been seeing on youtube i should be able to just pull this bad boy out let's see if we can at least get this off first Okay, we got the bottom one off. So I got to take this screw right here. I gotta take this screw. And there's supposed to be another one somewhere. But until I get that one off, I really, really can't see. I think that it looks like that's the only one. It actually looks like that's the only one. I think so. Okay, no, there's another one up in here that I have to also take out just to get this top part off. But so far, so good. Look how dirty that is, man. This car's been sitting for so long. I'm gonna clean this off before I put it back on. But look at that, oh my God. All right, I got it off. I don't know if you can see that good. Let me zoom out. All right, the sun is directly right here. But, all right, I got it off. So what I have to do is to put a pin into this hole right here at the same time turning this key and pulling. Well, I have to turn it to the own position and try to pull it out. So, uh, like I said, this is amateur hour. And we're gonna see if this amateur can do it. 
So I want to give you an example of what I have to do to actually put it in. See, it will not go over unless I do that. It will not go over. I have to, I have to wiggle or up and down until it turns. So what I want to do is just not have to go through all this. I mean, I can do it because I know how to do it. But at some point in time, my wife may need to drive this thing or whatever. So this thing got to go, man. Got to make it more accessible for her because, you know, sometimes I have to work on, on the Buick. Sometimes I have to work on the Buick, man. So, uh, yeah, let's see if we can get this out of here. All right, you guys, I got it out. Look how grimy this thing was. Look how grimy this thing is, man. I'm not saying that it didn't work, but it was not working like it should have worked. And you see why now? Look at this. It's probably some of these things in here. But, I mean, it cranked, but it was something that was getting stuck. Now I can see, like, it's all of this gunk that was in it. Look how dirty that is. Look at that. So let's see if we can put the new one in. Yeah, my goodness. So I finally got it in here. I mean, it, it took long on my on my part, but uh, when I got, it took me a while to figure out how to get it out and moving and wiggling to get it out. And then I finally got it out, which here it is, is the old one. I finally got it out and then I can't get it back in. And I was like, what is going on? I can't get this thing back in. So the inside of it had turned to another position and I had to put a little tool I just bought. I just bought this tool from Lowe's. So I went in there and I just turned it to the right position and I was able to slide it in. So now we're gonna connect the battery and see how, how well did I do? How well did I do, baby? Let's see. Let's see if it works. All right, so here's the keys. I took the keys out. I got it in. And um, these are all the tools I used. So let's see if the, let's see if the new key is gonna work. Uh -oh. Check them out. Check them out. Amateur hour. That's Kane. I've done it. <laughs> I feel good, really. This is my. So, uh. Like I said, I'll show y'all the dash. There's no check engine light on, oh, man. So y'all remember the radio that I put in with the Apple CarPlay? So, uh. We done it. Amateur hour, baby. Appreciate y'all for watching, man. Like, comment, and subscribe. Let me cut this. Like, comment, and subscribe for me, man. Try to bring y'all other videos of whatever I be doing, and especially on the truck. I still got a few things that I'm gonna do to the truck. I definitely want to tint the windows. Like I said, I'm gonna buy a new tail and headlights. You know, a little interior, change out the speakers and stuff like that. You know. Get the get the uh, the tailgate that where the bed lined up, you know. So it's pretty. It's other things that I I want to do to the truck. So you know, channel can continue to at least put something out there. Also, we have the Buick over there still. Let me zoom in on the Buick, baby. We still got the Buick, and there's things that has to be done to the Buick too. Not to mention, I'm thinking about buying a box truck, you know. I've been looking at this Amazon stuff and how people uh, you can be your own distributor. That's a that's that's a hustle, man. You gotta 
You gotta have some kind of hustle in here. At least try it. You know what I mean? You never know until you try. So, man, this is... I'm out, man. This is Hustle Man A64. This is the Hustle On Player channel. Y'all go subscribe to my my YouTube, my gaming channel also, because I do be doing gaming. But how at your boy, man. I'm out, man. I done it. I did it, baby. I did it. Look at that. I did it. Your boy is a certified amateur mechanic. <laughs>